if you ever say anything about what you have seen or done, that will be treason and you will have to pay for it. Probably with your life. Well, I really knew nothing about them and I rather liked their uniform, <laughs> which is terrible really to join something because you like the uniform. I had no idea that they were sending saboteurs over to France and I certainly didn't know that they were involved with SOE. My job wasn't a dangerous job at all, but it was very, I had to be very careful because that one mistake and someone's life could be in a dang danger. The ones that went over there, they, they had sometimes to suffer terribly. Many of them, of course, didn't come back. Many of them were tortured. They never gave it away. I don't think any woman agent from SOE ever gave anything away that mattered. They wanted us to go behind the lines, the German lines. Well, we all said yes, we would go. And we sat and waited and waited and waited. And nothing happened. And then one day they came in to us and said, Eisenhower has said he'll take the men, but he will not have the women on his conscience because he said, I don't think any of them will come back. So we were all furious. We really did feel we wanted to fight the Germans because we we were being bombed by them, many of our friends were being killed by them, and we really did want to fight them and wanted to get win the war. Well, our main thing was to win the war. And so I asked for it back, and I would run it myself as a charitable hospital. And we started then the first hospice in Europe for people with AIDS and ended up by being the biggest as well. The stigma was terrible. We had bottles thrown through the windows. We had people who wouldn't go into taxis unless it was all hosed down. And then of course we had Princess Diana who came, who rather changed everything. I woke up in the middle of one night and thought you've been caring for people with AIDS for 20 years. It's about time we did something to prevent the disease. And I spent the whole rest of the night trying to work out the best way. And I ended up with the fact it should be education through modern technology. And we are working all over the world and are meeting millions of people. I've just thought out for something to be done, I'll do it. I suspect it's the way I was brought up. Ha, ha, ha.